Hello, welcome to the vlog. So today is Tuesday. We're on our way to a pole dance day. My aunt's over there in that car. In that, in in that car. So we're gonna go pole. I'm gonna try to get footage on this camera to show you guys the poly dancer. So let's go in and let's get started. All right guys, we made it home. As you can see, I'm still working. There's still progress to be made, but we're getting better. Um, I wanted to show you guys some progress on my Starflake shawl. Because she is growing and I feel like I'm so close to the end that I can taste it. So I, I have to cake up more yarn, but I officially have the little V-strip things and some little holes here so yeah so i was right there this is how much i've done so i'm gonna cake up some more yarn so this is the starflake by stephen west a paid for fingering weight pattern and some outlander inspired yarn if you haven't heard the last season from what my mom is telling me the final season of outlander comes out next year on march 6th so we have so much outlander outlander yarn planning to do but we're gonna have this done so we can be wrapped up in it but we're getting there we are so close this thing is already huge it's already like down to my stomach so yeah, I'll probably film me. I'm gonna make some uh, fried rice with some leftover butter chicken sauce that I had. So I'll probably film me um, caking up yarn for this project um, and some knitting uh, shots. And then I'll probably see you guys tomorrow to do all the uh, appreciation day cooking instead of Thanksgiving, we can call it like Appreciation Day or Grateful Day. Since we don't support what, you know, Thanksgiving is about or stuff, but definitely a day to be thankful for, to be alive another day. And uh, yeah, so we're gonna get to cooking tomorrow. So probably be a couple shops after this and then we'll see you Wednesday.
Alright guys, so an update. I had a lunch break. The macaroni and cheese is done. Um, I, I'm assuming my husband is on uh, dishes. Uh, so he's washed a few dishes. Um, I actually made some macaroni for the guys with um, a homemade cheese sauce with what I had left over so they can eat today. Um, so now I'm going to get started with the dressing and the uh, sweet potato pies because I'm making two of them. So I'm going to get started with those and we'll come back. Alright, so this one came out pretty cute, right? Oh, look at the crust on that. I'm very ashamed. So, um, yeah, but my husband's saying that it's not really the crust that's burnt, it's like the little seasoning I put on it. I put like some cinnamon and stuff on it, but yeah, so there are the pies. Tomorrow we have the hams. And I'm going to make honey butter cornbread. So that is it for today. So I will see you guys tomorrow on the holiday. <sighs> All right, happy turkey day. So the attire today is casual. Cause I don't understand why people get dressed because we're finna like be stuffed. So, um, I'm about to get dressed. My knitwear of the day is my Muscle Burra, Muscle Berg, Muscle Burri. And um, yeah, I'm in love with this hat. Like, there's there's no question about it. I'm making like five more. But um, so I'm gonna put on some sweats and my apron. Show you guys a little bit of the setup. And it's probably gonna be quiet from here on out because my family will be here in laws will be here i'm sure music will be played i'm not gonna get copyrighted so um yeah so just come along throughout the day It is 1.50 on Saturday morning when this vlog is going to go up today. Um, but I wanted to end the vlog off with just saying thank you for watching and like some yarn stuff. Uh, so as you saw from whatever snippet you saw, we had an amazing week. Um, so yeah, I'm going to go ahead and uh, show you guys some yarn because I bought from a D stash. I got some really awesome stuff and yeah so a lot of this will probably be well let's see let's, let's hit it okay boom okay boom right there so um this d stash was from tiara i'm going to find it on So this D stash was from Tierra of the Love Stitch. She has a podcast on YouTube, and she also um, has her own shop. Oh, it has a website. So she has her own website, thelovestitch.com, where she sells project bags, and I'm assuming she's starting to sell yarn as well. Here's a little preview. So all this is from her D stash. And there were so many lovely things in there. God, I wanted to buy like half of it, but I didn't. So I'll show you what I got. That's no, no particular order. Um, this is my first skein of Nomadic Yarns. And it is called light as a feather, stiff as a board. 
it is a 50 gram skein of 231 yards, 75% superwash merino, and 25% nylon. And I know what you're thinking, Kira, you don't knit um, socks, so what are you doing with self striping yarn? I'm gonna make a muscle burg out of it. I already got my recipe. Oh, I didn't show you, I, fi I finished it. But. So I'm going to make a muscle burg, and I had about 40 something grams left. So I know I just need like most of this and then maybe something of a different color to shove in there. So that's what I wanna do with that. And then, it's a lot of firsts in here. And this is my first Wild Star Fibers yarn. I wanna get my hands on some more of her stuff though, it's so magical. Um, this is called Summer Splash. It's her Supernova sock set, 75% Superwash Merino, 85% uh, Superwash Merino, and 15% nylon. Comes with a 100 gram skein and a 20 gram mini. Look at how pretty that is. And that blue is everything. And I know what you're thinking. What are you going to do with that sock set? A muscle burg. Alright, and then the last thing. I got some um, Barocco Vintage DK. Um, I got three. And this is the color 2104. Um, I saw this and I love DK yarn and you never know what you what you need it for. So since I felt like that was something nice to have in the stash, it's a nice tan color. Good for color work, good for um, maybe like a, a underneath the thing, like a tank top or something if I ever knit one. But. So, came in this beautiful, look at that, it's so pretty. But yeah, so that's all I've got. Um, I will be filming a podcast on the 30th. Um, and I am so close, I can pick it up now, I'm so close to being done with my Starflake shawl. I've already rationed out like what I'm gonna do on what day and I am trying to be done by December 1st because we are starting vlogmas and we are going to be knitting a, a wave of change jacket together and another muscle burg muscle burra another beautiful hat so um thank you so much for watching this vlog and um, if you did like what you see please like comment subscribe and I will see you guys in the next one bye